to scoot back. Scoot back a little bit more. A little bit more. Scoot back. All right, good. Okay, we need that extension. So Dick's whole pike testing, this is a test that, um, being used for patients with vertigo or patients with benign paroxysmal positional vertigo. So I'm gonna check the left ear. Turn your head to the left. Don't move your head as you lie down, okay? So maintain this this position right that like that. And keep your eyes open. Alright, ready, set, go. Eyes open. Alright. So we're gonna wait up to 30 seconds. You're checking the eyes, right? Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna open, I'm gonna check this out. So there's no, no nystagmus, all right? That means she doesn't have a spinning sensation turning to the left. So that means negative on the left side. Now we're gonna check the right ear. So she might get dizzy getting, uh, sitting up, all right? So you're gonna sit up and make sure you hold the patient just in case she loses her balance. Okay, you okay? Are you dizzy? All right. Now we're gonna turn your head to the right, okay? So I'm gonna check the right ear. Now we're gonna do the same procedure, arms across, across your, um, your hands, across your chest, okay, good. Turn your head to the right, and then we're gonna go as fast as we can, but not too fast, all right? Ready? You, you check the, the eyes, all right? Ready, set, go. Eyes open. All right, right there. So there's a spinning sensation. There's a nystagmus. That's a classic sign of uh, vestibular dysfunction or benign paroxysmal positional vertigo. It should stop. Oh, keep, mm -hmm. keep your eyes open. It should stop in five seconds. Five, mm -hmm. four, three, two one did it stop mm -hmm. okay see that's mm -hmm. a classic nystagmus and she's positive for right benign paroxysmal positional vertigo now we're gonna do the apnees maneuver how do we cure this when you say benign paroxysmal positional vertigo it means it displaces crystals in one of the canals okay so we're gonna hold this for 30 seconds all right 30 seconds so Martin um, you're gonna when I say go you're gonna turn your head to the left all right mm -hmm. when I say go so keep, keep it there The good thing about uh, doing Epley's maneuver is we can cure the patient. Uh, we just have to recheck this maybe after two to three days, and um, and make sure you see your your local physical therapist or make sure you see um, a, a board certified vestibular specialist. All right, so five more seconds. Now I'm gonna turn the head to the left. She might get dizzy on this one. Mm -hmm. And then go tuck your chin right there. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna add 30 more seconds on this one. So Martin, um, after 30 more seconds, you're gonna roll to your left side, all right? You're gonna lie down on your left side, and we're gonna hold it for 30 to a minute. 30 seconds to a minute. Okay. So, we're gonna hold it for five more seconds. Now she's gonna she's gonna roll to her left side without turning her head. So this is gonna be a 90, 90 degrees. So she's looking down the floor. 
And again, we're repositioning the crystals where it belongs. All right, we're gonna hold it for 30 more seconds. And you can do this yourself. As long as you learn how to do it, just be very careful. Maybe five more seconds. Okay, so um, Martin, you're gonna uh, you're gonna sit up slowly. You're gonna swing your legs, your feet to the edge of the table, so you can sit up slowly. All right. On your left side. Yeah. You're gonna swing your legs again, and then sit up slowly. All right. And keep holding the patient because you might experience some dizziness and fall. Mm -hmm. So that's why I'm keep I'm keep uh, holding her. I'm holding her so we can maintain that balance. All right. So that's that's the treatment for patients with benign paroxysmal positional vertigo, and our success rate here is uh, more than ninety percent. So uh, the follow up. Follow-up session is gonna be uh, maybe today is Wednesday. Maybe I'll see her on Friday, um, and then I'm gonna give her a precautions. All right. So she has um, a right BPPV on the the right side, so she's not gonna sleep on the right side for one to two days. All right. Okay. Thank you. I'll see you soon. And uh, if you need physical therapy. Um, just call 516-867-5050. We have Dr. Reyes Lenin Queen. It's highly effective for dizziness. Uh, the phone number is 516-765-1430. Again, 516-765-1430. Andre, thank you so much. Yes. Yeah. Hi. I came here two days ago to get a vestibular therapy because I was suffering from vertigo. I had to go to the ER. They didn't know what was going on. So my neurologist asked me to find a vestibular therapist and I Googled Dr. Reyes and I found him. And I came here two days ago, he did the treatment. And I went home, he told me not to lay on my right side because every time I turn my head on the right side, I feel dizzy, the womb is always spinning with me. And I, I went home and I did all what he told me to do, not to lay on my right side, do not bend my head, do not look up for two days and come back and today is Friday to come back on Friday after 48 hours. So, but I went home, I didn't feel the symptoms because standing up, turning to the right, I'm dizzy, I'm spinning. And it was, it was very hard for me and it was a scary situation. So, I came back here, he said, I'm gonna cure you. He said that I'm gonna cure you. So I didn't feel anything yesterday, I didn't feel anything today. And he did the test today, and he told me I'm cured. And I felt it because the moment I put my head on the, on the pillow, usually my head is spinning, spinning, but this time I waited, I waited. I, I usually I feel, I always feel, I always felt the, it's coming, it's coming. This time nothing happened. I was waiting, waiting, I didn't see anything coming. So I'm waiting, really, really grateful for the knowledge of Dr. Reyes because it really helped me. Thank you very much.